Hey everybody and welcome back, EU4, Wealth of Nations, Multiplayer, Mathis, Aruma, Quill, myself. Hi. Hello. So between hey. episodes, Aruma's trying to sell me on the idea of being, like, just really mad at the game for the fact that <laughs> it put me in this uh, kingdom instead of being in a merchant republic, which is what's supposed to happen. Yeah. I'm also going to respond to the threat of a th claim thrown by doing that. I'm going to eat the stability <laughs> loss. I don't know how to wow. claim throne button works. We could still get PU'd if I die without an heir. How old's your guy? I'm 20. So I got time. It, it could happen. You know, in Crusader Kings 2, you can be a 17-year-old and you just die in your very first battle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or die a natural death. <laughs> yeah, natural cause. <laughs> old age. <laughs> oh, man, I can boost stability for super cheap now, though. It used to be like 250 to go up from like 0 to a plus 1, mm. and that'll be 92. That seems better. Yeah. Well, it's because, um, like, when you have no Republican tradition, like, unless you have 100% Republican tradition, the cost for stability is so high. Wait, when did the Ukraine show up? I freed them from Lithuania. Oh. Interesting. You freed, <laughs> freed them from their <laughs> oppressive rule. <laughs> is there something funny about that? I don't know. It's just the way you say it. You've, I freed them. This is a very hard-fought <laughs> war. Yeah. Basically, yeah, it was like, Nobody, you could either take people. over extension over like 150%, or I could free like this six province kingdom. I was like, yeah, it seems a lot better. Hmm. Don't like that very much, but sure. I would love to see France and Prussia fight a succession war over me, though. That, <laughs> that would, would be, be the great. way to end the yeah. series. If I just happen to keel over... And it starts, like, I'm hoping France jumps in and you're just like, yeah, let's do it. France, I have full faith you would win easily. I don't know. I think France could take me solo. I, listen, you have not, you don't realize how strong your troops are. <laughs> like, every time I, I load up the save and just fiddle mm. around with it in single player, Prussia, of course, like, instantly rivals me and then declares on me in a coalition war. Okay. And it just, like, just get run over by the AI. <laughs> I shouldn't have told you that. It's like, yeah, huh, what, el what else did they do? Hang on, to slow down. No, I'm not yeah. opening yeah. menus. <laughs> Why'd my force limit drop? <laughs> Maybe I built too many. Slightly over my limit now, but I probably still have mercs all over the place, so... Did you lose the bonuses from having the merchant faction focus? Uh, I did have the trading one, but that doesn't increase my force limit, I don't think. Oh, you're right. I think it's like, uh, it's the other one. The guild? The builders? Something like that? Yeah, or the aristocrats. <laughs> I don't know. There we go. I'm so, at exactly my force limit again. <clears throat> Good. I, so I think I just guy, produced units. My guy just died, and of course my Regency Council, 004. Oh, nice. With, without fail. Yay. <laughs> Hello? Oh man, the Sax uh. Lauenbergians are starting to like me a lot now. It helps that I could royal marry them. So I'm actually going to be able to annex them soon enough. Finally. Yeah. Arumba. What? Oh, you're still here, okay. Mm. On my end, you cut out for a minute, and I thought we were just, we had an unacknowledged, like, elephant in the room that you had disconnected somehow. Hmm. Nope. Well, okay. okay, I have relationship slots again. <laughs> Granada is literally, like, kicking Castile's ass. Like, they are <laughs> going to win the war. <laughs> What's the war for? Uh, oh. Defender against Castile. What the hell? Yeah. Castile declared, like, a reconquista, and Granada just... Kick their ass. Classic. Always biting off more than they can chew. So stupid. <laughs> See, normally I would dive, just jump on the opportunity to Royal Mary and ally Granada, but knowing, knowing that I cannot offer vassalization to them because they're the wrong religion is just... It's silly. Because <laughs> you used to be able to. Before before the change to Royal Marriage stuff, you could, you could offer vassalization to... Hmm different branches within the same religious group. Right, and they're... Oh, yeah, they're Catholic. Yeah, what the hell? Okay, this whole time, I I think I had it in my head that they were, like, Sunni or something. Yeah, that makes no sense at all, actually. We're all getting screwed. Well, I think it's maybe going I'll pretty just, well. I'm just gonna do it. And then I'll convert my religion again. Who's I, his commander? His I love the aftershocks here. of a war. 
where like you take over a bunch of land, kill all the enemy troops, and then the war is over, but then they get overrun by rebels. You're still kind of yeah. like, you know, <laughs> that feels good. I really want to go fight these uh, this 33 stack, but I don't want to cross with the 32 stack. And they have two to uh, tech points ahead of me, so... Ugh. Well, if you wait it out a little while, I might declare war on the Ottomans again. How long do you have till the wars so you can do that? It's like another year. That's not bad. I might hold on to it till for another year. I might Still want my manpower, siege, but... Siege roads here. I feel really bad for the Ottomans, actually. I never thought I'd get to that point, but I do kind of feel bad for them. We just you declare... legitimacy can't go below zero, right? I don't think so. Mm. Good, because I can annex Saxe Lauenburg, and uh, I'll still be at zero. It's great. Sorry, Castile, you're not coming over here, bud. Yeah, I gave Granada military access. I don't know why they need it, but... <laughs> Just in or, case. They're, maybe they're going to Castile in Florida the long way around. <laughs> I just hope they don't take so much land that they don't want to become my vassal anymore. Mm. But they, I mean, they've taken the capital. Their war score is 52. <laughs> That's just insane. What's wrong with Castile? Is France at war? I might finally be able to complete this mission. Nope. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, Siege of Rhodes is done. I have everything I can hold on to. They actually won't give anything up right now. Wow. And the stuff that I want doesn't cost that much, but they won't give it. They will. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. I'll wait them out. They can't do anything. Exactly. They can stare at me angrily from across the sea. <laughs> Even though I have Izmit, I can't really ferry troops across. Oh, maybe I can now that you have occupied Constantinople. Give me a second here. Well, they're blockading. Yeah, if the ships are there, you're still not going to be able to. All right. Well, I can at least walk into Constantinople. I can uh, I can go kill those ships if you want, though. Oh, it's all good. Just give it, give it some time. That's I'm sending them. Don't worry. They're on the way. Oh, oh the ships are moving yeah, immediately. They they're like, but, no, no. This is actually a really great way to prepare for uh, my war against the Ottomans. There you go. You have freedom now. Oh, where did you come from? Mm, Swedish Patriots. Haven't seen you in a while. Ooh, that is a 6-5 leader. No big deal. Yeah, hey, I'll protect the Constantinople area with these boats. Thank you, thank you. Who needs to let manpower replenish? Are you at war with them now? No, not yet, but very soon. Yes, they're gonna about to be. Uh, let's see. I want to take the Alexandrian guy out of there because I remember put like a million men in boats over there to pull it away. He took about three of my gold away from me. Very upset. Oh, I love the fortify missions. Just giving you free manpower. Sometimes they only give you five army tradition instead right. of also giving manpower. I don't know why. All the ones so far have given me manpower. Well, at least I guess all the ones I've taken. I, I maybe just see the others and then ignore them. I mean, not that army tradition is bad, but it's less, less cool. Ooh, I have an Inquisitor available now. Cool. An opportune time. Is the Inquisitor okay, one. religious uh, plus, tolerance? Plus two, plus two missionary strength. Oh, okay. This is the opposite. He's, but... uh, yeah. Yeah, he's, he, you're thinking of the theologian. Mm. Minus revolt risk guy. They should just rename him, you know, just call, don't call him a theologian, just call him minus revolt risk guy. <laughs> and then, <laughs> that way people would always know. <laughs> yeah. That's a movie Isn't that with a Vin movie? Diesel. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to say. <laughs> That's funny. The pacifier. I just got this picture of Vin Diesel in my <laughs> head with like the soother in his mouth now. That's the that's the terrible. poster. Is it? What? No. Yeah. I would. If it is, I would be very happy. You've I don't got, actually believe you, but he's it got would be like fantastic. a backpack on. I assure you, this is this is real. He's got a backpack on and he's taking care of some kids. So he's like uh, Mr. Nanny. Is that what yeah, he's yeah, like, like that. Like yeah. the CIA Hulk Hogan agent that has to protect like some like powerful leaders kids or something like that i think there's like 15 movies with that exact same plot yeah <laughs> they all star vin it's... diesel so oh, all right yeah it's reasonable this doesn't make any sense i'm rivaled with the ottomans i took all that land you, like you guys saw all that land that i took right mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. power projection 
Nothing. No conquered land from enemies, just nothing. Oh, is it because it's distant overseas? It might be, because it's... I mean, I have none. I am at Wait. 36. I was expecting to be almost at 100. Called to arms against my own country. Hang on. <laughs> the, the, the nation of Great Britain, your faithful allies, requesting that come to their aid in the British conquest of Cado against Cado and Canada. Oh, okay. So, if I joined right now, I would be at war against Canada. My subject. What? Seems like a silly choice. shouldn't be allowed. Seems like something... Yeah, you should probably say no to that. Yeah, but it's... They shouldn't have been able to call me in. It might have been automatic. This makes no sense. Well, now Canada's going to get its ass kicked by Great Britain. Why... Wait, hold on. Why am I not in the war on the other side? Because you're... I should have been called your in. Your colonial subject will call you in when they start to lose. Okay. They won't call you in until you are until they're losing. They can't. Okay. I just figured if there was an actual, like, big power fighting one of my colonies... Like, if Great Britain just declared war against Canada, surely I would get called in right away, wouldn't I? Yeah, you would think. Yeah. I guess yeah. it's because there's Cadu it's... in between... Cadu must be what? Their subject? I don't know. It's one... What no, is they're it? just allied. It's a one... Pro C-A-D-D-O. It's a one province minor that for some reason Canada decided to ally to. Right. And now it's going to lead to their death. Are you thinking of going to war? I'm definitely going to go to war, but not... Uh, why? I said, when you go to war, let me know, because I'll march my men across and just jump into this fight with you. Yeah, exactly. Um, um, the only thing I would request is let me siege a couple of lands so I can jack my war scorp real quick and yeah, be out of it. You can, you can jack it way up however I you want to do it. I jack it up. I jack it down. <laughs> but then when side you... Side. The, in, in return, when you peace out, leave Constantinople. Gotcha. Because that's my, that's my treasure right there. And then we'll right. have taken out the Ottomans, and it's up to Quill and Aruba to get Ile de France. Oh, oh, I see. <laughs> well, how about you put Quill into a personal union, and then it's on you to take care of France because mm. you'll have to fight France over it. How old is Quill's ruler? He's, he's only 22. Give him some time. Well, since you're the same dynasty, it, pre it pre presents you with a, like a unique opportunity here to claim their throne and to, to gain over quill basically <laughs> <laughs> can he he can't claim my throne without the royal marriage though right or can you still uh, uh I yo, you're right i couldn't in advance yeah so if you broke the royal marriage i probably couldn't that's true yeah that's why i was well, surprised I that you accepted it in the first well, place i didn't but. i i still don't understand royal marriages they're like black magic sorcery or not royal marriages but like personal unions and claiming the throne yeah yeah, I've I've done it once successfully. As Poland, I got Lithuania, and then I somehow got Muscovy, and I was like, okay, like th this is the greatest game ever. And then I didn't play EU four for like four months. <laughs> <laughs> got Walk away on a high note. Uh, so I need uh, just a second, Mathis. That's fine. Just a second here. My war score is ticking there, every month, so... I mean, with cl getting those PUs, there'd be no point to continue that game. Be like, alright, I've already won. Yeah. GG. At least that's the way I play it. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> Won't accept vassalization. Yep, Granada's too big now. They won their war. They're too big to accept vassalization. Oh, you little bastards. This will have to wait. What's <laughs> their on. religion? I'm going to go take care of some rebels first. Hang on a second. Look at them. The well, good job, Granada. Um, This would be cheaper. All right, man. This... Hang on a second. I'm not <clears> ready yet. I got to go take care of these rebels. All right, man. This... <laughs> That's all I need is middle of a war, and then one of my lands becomes independent because just, they're whiny. You let me know. Because I am ready to, to take them out. Sounds good. Oh, they're, they've moved, or they're moving. Yeah, because I moved out of the... Yeah, I moved out of Darren, <clears> so they're like, okay, he must not gonna, he's not going to attack us. Oh, it's not. I, I want them back, though. Yeah, I'll be going back there in a second. You want to cut off the head of the snake? 
They should be moving back now. I'm not suggesting that all people of Ottoman descent are snakes. <laughs> <laughs> it may have come out incorrectly. Peace, God. Why are you so mean to us <laughs> Ottomans, Northern Lion? I'm sorry, Swedish Ottomans. <laughs> All right, I'm ready when you are. All, All right, right. I, I want to wait for them to be back in the. Oh, they're there. Okay. Let's yeah, wait. so they, they, they have to have been moving back already. So. We'll wait for your wow. morale to tick up. I have had a two stack of infantry in Greenland for like the last hundred years. <laughs> I feel so bad for these guys. <laughs> That's great. That's All funny. right, Mattis, you ready? Yep. yep. Okay, here we go. Declare war. Pause. Okay, so oh, now he's like, I'm coming for you. They're ya. coming for you with Forced yeah. March. So let me just look at this for a second. How do I turn on Forced March? You don't have it if you haven't finished uh, Offensive Ideas yet. Okay, that'll do it. So they're going to be there in seven I'm not days. Gonna, yeah, I don't know if I can... They're going to they're gonna beat me there. So, so what I'm going to do is head back to Constantinople quickly, and I can join you. Okay, yeah, I'll just stay here and defend. Yeah, do you have... You should... Is that your best leader? 1102? That's my only leader, yep. Do you have military power to get another one? Uh, yeah, I could. Let me... I guess we could farm for one. <laughs> uh, let's see. How about you? I'm not, I'm also not in my country, so I can't swap leaders out. Oh, God. That's true. But you're in friendly territory. Does that count? Yeah, yeah. All right, cool. Let's try it. I just got a 2000. Zero, 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 zero. <laughs> see you later, buddy. It was nice knowing you. What's your armor uh, tradition? Zero, one, two, zero. Oh, it's okay. You yeah, know what? You, you probably just don't have the tradition, man. It's not worth burning 50 points at pop. All, All right, right, I'm done. I'm coming over. All right, I'm waiting. Yeah, it's 33 versus 31. I think I'll be able to hold out till you show up. Yeah, they're gonna have a huge crossing penalty. Your leader is garbage, though. Oh my god! <laughs> they wow, are they just straight me. up melting you. That's all right. I got a, like a hundred thousand oh, oh, coming in. Let's hold that for another turn. Oh, I wow. Okay, I actually did really well in the next like die roll. I gave you the 52,000 men. I Hell assumed yeah. you did Obviously. pretty well. Yay! I won that fight. My morale is awful. I won that fight, this guy. <laughs> Look, man. <laughs> oh, man. I'm here. Game's starting to chug a little right. bit here. I'm going to siege this land. I need uh, Hood Vendigar. Okay, so I'll siege the other land. Yeah, then. you can push a little bit forward into the material. Uh, yeah, I'll head down towards, like, Rhodes area. Sure. Whatever you feel that you need to do, you do. Hope my guys can win that oh, battle. Do you need me to swing over? Nah, I don't think so. Just want to kind of put up like a little bit of a wall of, of men so that I can have like low... Um, I don't know why I just got conquest against you, Quill, but... Um, there was an event that just gave you oh, a Oh, okay. Sure. Like, ow. It's all good. They were so excited when you declared war, man, they just jumped right across that water. <laughs> <laughs> well, this should be Constantinople for us then. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, you could take it and just give it to me if you want to. Yeah, that, that works too. It'll but, be easier. Well, it's it's like 86. It's worth 86 war score, so probably not. <laughs> How am I even going to get to 86 <laughs> war score? Man. Well, Russia is helping, so that's good. So I have, um, remember I mentioned that I turned on all my pop-ups are back up again? Yeah, yeah. I keep on getting spammed by, like, Castile and France. Like, they give hundreds and hundreds of ducats to their colonies. And I just think that's really poor programming. I mean, Castile just lost a war to Granada. Mm. And then a second later, they give, like, 150 ducats to one of their colonies. <laughs> wow. It's like, maybe you should, you know, build some army. <laughs> Silly. How is Crimea even... Like, Russia, <laughs> you're supposed to crush them. <laughs> they escaped, man. They ran. They did. A gift was exchanged, my king. The selflessly gener selfless generosity of Castile. They have donated 50 ducats to Lenop. <laughs> Should probably be, like, sending more money to things. I'm really worried that Canada is just going to lose this war. 50 ducats. I have no idea. Can you can you enforce peace? Uh oh, I tried more than once, and like, Great Britain is not willing to do it. Canoe doesn't like me enough. That's 
not gonna help. No, we could stay together, Ryan. Stay together. Where, where though? Uh, right in Con Konya. I'm just moving my three stack out of there. Hopefully, I'll get out of there in time. I will. I'll be out of there. But then they can push back into Hamad. Because they're gonna. But then, they're we can pin then we can. But then we can pinch them there. If they move into Hamid, then we'll you just wanna, fucking... You want to attack them here? Yeah, just try and crush them. All right, because they're going to Mintes now. Yep. I was saying, don't give them the... Just let them move in too far in, and then just take them. All right. Yeah, exactly. Bam. Is this, yeah, it's going to get him. Oh, Kadu needs an opinion of at least 100 before I can enforce peace on their behalf. What the mm -hmm. hell? <laughs> it's always... Always been that way. It's always this been is just ridiculously stupid. There's ridiculously no way high. that this should make any sense for uh, that I can't defend Canada against Great Britain. I mean, I guess I could just declare war on them. I don't have a CB right now, though. No, that's not true. I can. Well, it's the end of the video. I'm gonna have to like rage about this for a week. And <laughs> consider my options. <laughs> Arg. Seems sounds fair. Not quite. Oh, I do like the missions to like yet. just insult. Yeah, them, not though. not yet. Considering it's the last was, video of the week, we got a we got an interesting situation against the Ottomans here. By if right. interesting, I mean crushing them. We are, but they they still have enough troops that if they just push forward like to our weak point, they could cause some real problems. Luckily, the AI we can kind of play around that. Sort of, but I don't know. Mostly, these are my troops, Mathis. So I'm like, <laughs> I'm trying to make sure it's all good because there's now 17 more thousand coming from Oman. I'm sending money to Canada. I'm hoping they just like merc up or something. I got we got a 28 stack right there. Do you see him? Yeah, I'm assuming 16. And the the problem is that they can go to oh my god almost and they there's like three different provinces they border. Why don't so, we just march and take them then? Nah, I'd rather oh there's a surrender there. So now we yep. can. We'll I don't want to. We'll I don't want to take them yet. Okay, I don't want to take them yet. You want to move up to Castanu or whatever it is? I'm gonna stay here just so they don't push in. Okay, but if they push I'm in, seriously discussing. Really, yeah. Or debating the idea of declaring war in Great Britain. Just to, oh, I got the marriage. God damn it! <laughs> okay, I got another siege down. Good. And then after like all of the bordering province siege is finished, we'll just all move in and crush yeah. them. And then once the army's yeah, once the army's down, and hopefully that's enough war score, I'll take what I need and I was bounce say, out. After, after you peace out, then I'll resiege everything. Mm-hmm. But they should have really low garrison sizes, right? Like I would assume. Ah, oh, and they're and they speed. their war enthusiasm is real low right now too. I have to imagine they've been fighting like an endless war for the past twenty years. <laughs> but for now, just let it let it tick by a little bit. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a like we've been on point with our time this week, but. It's been a little longer. Like every episode, there's been like a couple minutes. Yeah. It's okay though. It's a good game. GG. I my transports. There they are. Um, you come up here, maybe here. And okay, we got that one now. Yep. Nice. I would just keep them there. Where do you want to stack our men on, in, on our No, I, th I think we should come in from all three sides. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't think it'll matter. I can send in like a really small force with uh, forced march just to make sure that they have to stay there. Oh, there's another one you took? Yeah. Oh, man. I just got a bunch of force. Mm, I just took one. Yeah. So with this one that's at 28 right now. Ah, there it is. It's done. Um... So I'm just taking eight more men up here, this just to be sure. Yep, that's fine. I'm moving another six over to Konya. So your leader, no offense, is garb is garbage. Is I got garbage. You. Uh, mine, okay. I have I have a six five that we can use. So I'm gonna force to march into there, but not yet. Okay. Did you see the movement? Yes. Yeah, so okay. I saw <laughs> really that I'm was, gonna do it. Not yet. It was no. a little accidental. Um, this might be the last major battle the Ottomans ever fight. All right, so I'm gonna go on three, two, one, go. All right. Goodbye, Ottomans. Should be good. Yeah. What's their leader? They're not even trying to run. Yeah. Well, they can't. 
Unless, well, I guess they could have tried to force march, but. Wah, nope. wah. <laughs> that was the end of the uh, the Ottomans. Yeah, that feels pretty good. I don't even want to be in this mm. area. Oh, they just lost 3,000 in two ticks. That's rough. Oh, they're coming around this way now. Let's go catch them. I'm going to try. Well, I mean, they're going to walk into my men, so they'll be there for a little bit. They can't go yeah, far. Yeah, I'm going to force march oh, into They them. stopped. Oh. I don't know what they're doing. I'm coming actually. back down then. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, there they go. Okay. They're, they're not going to make it in time. We can wipe them out. I think. It's a long walk, but oh, right. plenty of time. Wow, it was a good good walk there, man. This. Yeah, my men got to right. go to something. Great, how many troops do you have? 46,000 troops. That's all you have? Pretty sad, right? F you, Great Britain. <laughs> How dare you go and get to war against Canada? Nice. All kinds of wrong. What's, what's this? What's your war score? Russia wants military access? Sure. Yeah. My war score is 51 now. 53 after that. Hmm. It's up to you. Um, yeah, I'm going to see if they'll give me what I need, what I All want. Right. And then we can end this marathon. Yeah, uh, so I want um, that, 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 and that. Oh. Not quite. <laughs> Not quite. Very close. They'll give me almost all of them. That's alright. We Sorry. can continue this song and dance next week. Yeah. Sounds like it might be a good idea. Plus it'll let me consider exactly how I want to invade Great Britain. <laughs> Those bastards. Oh right, you're doing another major world war. <sighs> Soon. But yeah. Kinda sucks that we didn't up. touch France for a whole week, but... I know, it's terrible. I like when I touch France. Don't be gross. We, you know, we definitely messed with the Ottomans a bit. Yeah, the Ottomans are not looking like they're in a fantastic position. How, no, how long until your truce good. timer expires, uh, Arumba? Uh, well, I have a Regency Council for three more years, and my truce timer is in two. So. <laughs> By the time I get out of this war, you could just declare again and take like the rest yeah. of the Middle East. Yeah, but unfortunately, I wanted to attack the Mamluks and Algiers during this time when they were separated from mm. the Ottomans, but Regency Council, so. Well, I yeah. guess we're ready. Yep. That was a heck of a week. It yeah, was. sure was. It's a pleasure as always. Uh, if you enjoyed the episodes, click the like button. It helps out a great deal, showing your support. Subscribe to whoever's perspective is preferred, and uh, that's the most convenient way for you to get new videos every day, which there will be. We're going to be back tomorrow. As always, thanks for watching. We'll see you then. Bye. Bye-bye. See you soon.